this one's going to be on, uh, I guess, part three of this. Uh, first one we talked about was URL views, and then we talked about URL scan. Well, this one is going to be on uh, using W3M as a um, you know URL extractor launcher, but with contacts. And I say this one is probably the best one for contacts because it actually takes a screenshot of the whole uh, screen here. And... Um, You'll see in a minute, okay. So right now we have our uh, was our WeChat here, right? Uh, once we press our high key, it's going to enter into the twilight zone here. So if I hit this here, you see it takes a picture of it, and it's all uh, black and white. But once you hit your um, your colon, or they call it command or whatever, so you hit your colon, it'll go into Pleasantville. You have colors. Look at that, right? Now you have colors and it will, you know, the colors that signifies those are uh, the links. And you can use your uh, W3M hotkeys, either tab to go between them like this, or shift tab to go um, backwards. Or you can use J and K like Vim style to move around. Or you can just hit, um, what is that, uh, escape and M to find um, all the links on the screen. So you see escape and M, they give you all these um, pop up here. And you can hit uh, either A, B, C, or D, or J and K to go up and down. And you can choose one of them. So let's say I choose uh, this Google or whatever here. Right, it jumps to it. Now, if you want to open it with uh, W3M, then all you got to do is hit push enter and open it with W3M. Okay. Otherwise, let's go back here. If you hit, uh, if you want to open it with your uh, GUI browser, this is what you gotta do so you gotta be careful here make sure you hit escape first so it's kind of like in vim you go back to normal mode so hit escape first if you don't hit escape this is what's going to happen if you just hit uh, shift and m it'll give you this uh can't browse uh standard in whatever right so you have to hit escape and then you hit the uh, shift m and then uh, that will open you know the web browser here otherwise it won't work if you just type in um uh, was that uh, shift and M only like after you move or whatever right and you just hit the uh, shift and M it's not gonna work you have to hit escape first and then shift and M and that will open uh, you know your uh, web browser the GUI version otherwise if you want to just use uh, W3M whatever all you gotta do is just uh, go to that uh, link and push enter and it'll open it with uh, you know your W3M web browser here. So that's how you use it with uh, W3M just for context. And it looks much better than you know the URL scanning one because you can see that it'll take uh, the whole screenshot of it. And all you gotta do is hit the was that the colon and now you have all your links, right? So that's it for that. Now how do you set this sucker up? Get out of here. And let me quit out of this thing we don't need this no more there we go so to set this up in tmux you go into our tmux here uh, so these the two ones I talked about was uh, the URL view URL scan and this one is just w3m so it's pretty much the same thing just replace it with um, you know w3m in the correct place and you can use it um, put that in your tmux and this one only works, I guess it only works in Tmux. So I don't know how you, well, you can actually use this with, uh, I guess, uh, some of the other programs too. Okay, like, like Mutt or something. But that's it for that, using W3M.